Okay, hello everyone. My name is Nehi Shah and I'm a Macrame business coach. And today I want to welcome you to our Hall of Fame interview of Macrame Artist Hub, where we have a very special community member and she's here to share her Macrame business journey with us today. So let me introduce to you Divya Renwa. We have, we have her here today. Uh, let me give a little introduction about her. She's a student. She's done her BA LLB. She runs a Macrame business also. And apart from being a macrame artist, she loves to sketch portraits. She's a digital illustrator. She loves to paint. And uh, she also says that apart from the time that she's, um, before she got into macrame uh, community and she learned macrame, and since she's got into it, her business has taken an amazing curve and turn. Okay, so let's welcome Divya over here and let's directly hear from Divya itself. Amazing, Divya. So hello, Divya. Hi. Hi, Snehi. Amazing. So... so so tell us that how was your life before you joined Macrame Artist Up? What did you do before and what are you doing now? Like what, what, what how has your uh, life been, your journey been till now? Okay, so before Macrame, my life was okay. Like I was doing sketching, I was doing illustrations, like I was selling bullet cards, everything I was doing. But I like in 21, I think I started my page. I wanted to like start my own business. And then for like one and a half year, I did the same thing. I did many portraits, but it was like a long time consuming. I know it's good, but it's very time consuming. And the other person was like, Are, they are really hesitate to pay the amount because... We know that it takes three days, four days sometimes, but they're unable to pay that much. Then I was like, Chalo, kuch aur try karte hai. Then I found you on Instagram and I feel really grateful for that. And then from that day, like I started learning macrame from you. Uh, the silver membership I joined, I learned slowly the keychain, the earrings, etc. Everything. And then slowly, like uh, I like you said, how to measure the coach and everything. And from that time, I feel that um, I'm very busy right now. Like, Achha, whatever if, if I was doing uh, sketching, I'd be like, it was very stress on my head. Are, I need to match the expectations of the customer. But now, if I'm making macrame products, I know that I should satisfy myself. I know the other person will like it or not. And I'm grateful for that. that I mean, whatever I'm making is, is really beautiful. And I'm thankful for you for making me learn this thing. And uh, I'm very like, uh, first though, I was like, TK, I let them, I should give my, I should, I used to show my mom, my mom, uh, she was, she's also an artist. I would show her like, please let me know how this portrait, I'm not satisfied. And now though, she comes directly and say, Ye wala poster jada lag Hello, I'll do the cutting. And I like, mommy, before that, I used to call you, mama, please see, please. And now you are only coming directly. Even now when I do this uh, clutch and all, na, she only comes, la, meko de de, I'll do, la, meko de de. she does the uh, combing of the fridges, she stitches the tags. She's more interested in my business uh, than before. I'm like, Achha, chalo, ek or business partner aage mere saath mein. So I'm like, now my my uh, bond with my mom is growing even more. Before that, I was not talking that much. Like, haan, thik hai na, bata do, bas kasa karna hai. Now that she's like, are, I'll let you know, I'll let you know. She only comes and let me know the combinations. Are, ye jata chale ga, are, ye kar, ye kar. She sees, uh, in my father, she some, finds something on Instagram, na. He shares me. Are, ye wala bana, this is looking more good. Are, let me okay. wait. Wait and it's just like everyone is very happy with macrame that I'm doing, so I'm really grateful for that. Amazing, amazing! That's awesome. That's such a beautiful thing that you sh you share that you're being able to bond with your mama and papa better now, and it's helping and it's it's amazing to have them uh, supporting you and uh, yes, kudos yes. to that. That's amazing. That's awesome. Super. Um, and you also mentioned like uh, like your student, right? So yes. how are you managing your business and student like? What, how are you balancing both the things out? Mostly together? like now to I'm doing PGDM, right? So we are having like half day college. So it is, it is even more uh, nice that I do half day college. Then I come home, I get fresh up and I sit on my table. And on Sundays, so I won't move from my table only. My brother comes and say, just move from here, go out of the room. I like, I like this area. I like my cords. I like my table. I'm here. I don't want to move. Like, thoda bahar nikal, picture ja, khana khana ja. Eh, I don't want anything. I am enjoying this space. I am like that. My father is like, you will go crazy with this cray, uh, cord. Just come out of the room. Everyone are tired of me because I love this. Now I'm, I'm like, oh, I, I want to do this in my life now. This is the best thing I found. So I am just doing this only. I am loving this. Wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. I am loving the dedication and commitment that you have. So amazing on that. That's awesome. So um, I would also love to ask you that um, if you can share some tips, uh, not tips as in, if you can share that, where are you getting your orders from? Like you're getting it from Instagram, you're getting it from word of mouth. 
uh, how are you getting your orders so uh, in starting i was totally based on whatsapp i was only posting on whatsapp then i got to know that let's post on instagram and uh, everyone thinks that our family members will uh, purchase from us or our relatives will purchase from us but it i got to know that nothing works for me only instagram worked mostly and then uh, i kept a stall in my hometown and it was so surprisingly the first day was amazing like there was no time gap between on my table that are i am empty nobody is coming to see my product it was so great so then that time i got to know the relatives doesn't come the one who doesn't know you comes and purchases from you that one thing and then then instagram instagram is doing really great for me and uh, i think the previous month during february i boosted a post on instagram and that was so great for my month from that day uh, i'm just boosting my post one thing and then second thing is like um, word of mouth is second thing because uh, some uh, uh, i sent a kitchen to a person like five to seven people and they were like this recommended to their friends and their friends came and purchased from me so word of mouth does great thing for me amazing amazing thank you so much for sharing that that's really deep insights and i'm sure everyone who's watching this interview will also get a lot of tips and um, ideas from your uh, experience so thank you so much for sharing that also with everyone out here super amazing so um, to ask you one um, one question that how uh, your journey and what are the three things that shifted in you after coming coming to the silver membership any top three things that made a difference in your life like that shift you could see instantly um, after you came into the uh, macrame artist hub one i can say that i am deeply involved in one uh, specific thing before i was totally scattered i i would do this that this but now i'm totally focused that okay we should do one thing at one time that is a great lesson i learned this one and second is uh, it is only the i mean if you are successful tomorrow it is only the hard work you do today this is the second thing the best thing i learned that if you work today then only you are like tomorrow you will sit and relax and you will have people working under you if you don't work today you will not get anyone you have to keep working and working and working and uh, these are the two best thing i learned in this macram and these are the best things in my life if i can say till now amazing amazing thank you for sharing that and one last thing that if you had to give one golden nugget from your experience to other macram artists out here other women out here what would be that one golden nugget that you can share from your side first thing is that never compare yourself to other because you can see there are instagram pages there are so many followers and you will think that are i have just 100 followers i just 10 followers who will purchase from me there is nothing like that there will be one day that your reel might might be uh, viral or there are there may be something that overnight nothing happens it will take time if you think aaj main instagram open kiya and i will get instantly like 100 followers 10000 followers it will nothing happen day by day, you increase just don't get panic don't get stressed that are i'm only one follower in a month only two followers in a month it's okay things goes when they want to be in place this is the uh, first thing i would like to uh, say them and don't get very excited like i want to do this 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 sabhi mujhe products banana hai no get uh, specific in one thing like if you see your instagram page i saw page uh, where they are only making swings the huge swings the small swings that they are specified in that so try all your products and then see which is doing good for you which you are perfect in it don't make things don't make everything and don't get scattered i mean like uh, jo ek cheez banao wo best banao ya pure cheezon ke andar nap ko jao this is all i want to say them that's amazing 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 and um, very insightful and thank you so much for sharing that and um, one last thing we would love to know how much revenue have you generated from your macrame business already till since you started till today what's the revenue you've generated so the revenue i earned from the day one till yesterday is like 2 lakhs 30000 approximately and uh-huh. it is really uh, i'm really i really feel very grateful by uttering this uh, revenue i earned because uh, recently i checked how much i earn now i can uh, proudly say that from my own business the money i kept in my courts i earned 2.3 lakhs and wow. i am really thankful to snehi i am really thankful for you um, because if you were not there this 3.3 2.3 lakh wouldn't be there <laughs> that's amazing it's good to learn but the best part you've done is you've implemented right we all learn and just leave it there but implementation is the most and you've done an amazing job on the implementation so all hard work is yours and all dedication is yours so amazing for that thank you so much for sharing 
and uh, thank you so much for being here on this interview and spreading your insights and um, takeaways from your macrame business and um, for everyone who's here and watching this uh, video go check out divya's instagram page it's called divya renwa uh, underscore arts on instagram i will even link her um page uh, under this video so you can directly click on it visit her profile place some orders and um, just expand help her expand her business also and uh, for everyone out here like divya even if you wish to start a macrame business right from the comfort of your home no matter whatever you're doing even if you have another business or even if you have you're studying or you're a homemaker anyway if you want to start your macrame business come for my free master class where i'll be sharing three secrets on how you can start your macrame business and start generating income also the link to join the free master class is also under this video so do check that out and sign up and um, if you would like to see many more interviews like this many more inspiring hall of fame interviews like this don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit on the like button and share this with uh, any more women you know who would want to start on this journey amazing super thank you so much divya thank you so much for joining in today and we will see you very soon again Thank you. Thank you. Bye.